It's time for Tech Time with Timmy. Hello, welcome to Tech Time with Timmy. In this episode, Timmy's going to be talking about how to pair your TP-Link light bulbs or smart switches or any TP-Link Casa devices with Google Home. So TP-Link light bulbs and TP-Link switches are things Timmy's talked about in a few previous episodes quite recently. And along this line of TP-Link smart devices, there's a whole lot of stuff called the CASA range. And in one really easy step, that can they can all all of your devices from TP-Link CASA can easily be connected in with Google Home, which is a really cool smart speaker that Timmy's talked about many times before. So that you can just ask Google Home to turn on any of those those devices or turn them off or dim them if they're lights and stuff like that. So it's really cool. So you really just easily connect your TP-Link account once and then all the TP-Link devices all pair in instantly. So that's really cool and in this episode Timmy's going to show you how to do that. Okay, so you need to get your phone or tablet and open up the Google Home app. So you probably should already have the Google Home app and if you don't you can really easily download it. So once you're in the Google Home app, just on the home screen here you can tap add and then tap set up device and so you have the device setup menu here and you need to tap on works with Google because TP-Link isn't by Google it just worked with Google so here's all the services that you can connect to Google Home and you need to just scroll down until you find TP-Link so here it is under T it's TP-Link Casa so you can just tap on that and then it takes you around to this window here. So now you need to enter your TP-Link account details, so email and password that you would have set up when you were setting up your account in order to set up the devices. So that's a really easy process that you follow then. So you need to make sure you need to find wherever you've stored this information and enter it in here and then just tap authorize. And now it says linking your TP-Link Casa account. So now you need to select smart home devices that you want to add to a room. So tap all the ones that are going to be in one room and then tap add to room and now you tap the, the room that these ones are going to be in. So you just select whichever one you want and then just tap next. And so now those devices you just selected are saved into the room you selected. And so now you'll need to come back here, you'll be brought here and you need to scroll all the way down and you find these other two devices. So it depends how many devices you had in CASA. If they're all for one room, it would all be done already. But if you had multiple devices in multiple rooms, all the ones you haven't chosen a room for will be in here under in your home. So there's these two here. So you can just tap on each one, for example, lamp, and just tap on settings, and then tap add to home, and tap home, and next. And now you can choose what room that device is going to be in. So studio, and then you just tap next. And now it says device was moved, so it says room studio. So that's good. And so if you go back, there's just one device that doesn't have a room now. So you can go into this one as well and basically do the same procedure. And so now it says that device was moved, was moved around as well. So you can just keep going through like that until you've moved all of your devices into the right rooms and you can easily create new rooms if you need to. So then it's really just moving all the devices into the different rooms in the app to get more organized. And so that's really all. And then once you've done that, you've got all your devices being able to be controlled by Google Home. So you can just say, hey Google, turn on the studio lights. Lights. So that's really cool. And that'll be the end of this episode of Tech Time with Timmy. Bye.